this is little Josephine, or Josie for short. And she is a mechanical music box in that her little body moves around when she plays. It does not play very long. She is the only doll that I have that has this um, sugar britches face. Now originally the doll would have her eyes closed, or so what I did is I came back in, I painted her eyes. She's got these really, gosh, pouty lips. Look at those pouty little lips and that look on her face. I also painted her hair in. I gave her this really cute hairdo. This is actually how I styled my boys' hair when they were babies. I would uh, comb all their hair to the middle and then give them the curl on top. A little faux hawk, baby faux hawk. So I gave her all these cute little swirls and curls and little wavy things. Knowing that her hair would be covered up most of the time anyway, with her little bonnet. Now on her dress, <clears throat> I could not take the dress off of her, so I I sprayed it and then I kind of brushed it with stain because it really wasn't working very well with the spray with some dye and, and I was avoid in order to avoid the area where the mechanism was you see that I didn't put anything right there one thing I did do was to stitch she's going to continue to play by the way for me messing with her I did and there she goes again and she is possessed so I did stitch her little gown down so it shows up better and she's got these cute little little fists, see her little fisties? I, I put her in a crawling position. I don't know what position she's supposed to be in, but I can't see her laying down with her that body. Right now she's not in the crawling position because I straightened her up when I was messing with her. I had her in this little crawling position so that it kind of boosted her up a little bit better and I think that really helps her take some of the weight off of her hands. I did put some stitches in her dress to kind of hold it in place. You see when she's not, you have to sit her right on her on her box, her little mechanism. And right now she's sitting on a plastic container I use for my photo stand and it's a little warped. So she does want to rock over. Right now her weight's kind of balanced over the wrong way. Okay, hang on. So that's her little issue. She wants to kind of tip if she gets too over to one side. So you gotta watch out for this girl, not leave her in this position. So basically when you're winding her up and down, she will not move until, unless you do it by, with the key. Please don't over tighten the key, it will strip it. But anyway, that's my girl, and oh, what else was fun about said? There's her spider. I think her heart, did I put her heart on her? Oh, you know what? Let me look at her booty. I may not have her heart on her yet. Mm, I'm going to really look at her. I think I meant to put it right there. So I did see a spare one sitting around. I think it most meant for her. Over the back. Huh. Now she going. I do see some little things. I need to unbind her collar. Fix that a little bit better. But you can, you know, well, you can take that off if you want. You can put, display her like this where it shows her off better. It all works. Now, one thing that's cute, and I will show a picture of her with her sisters and brother, is that she's just a different doll that you can look at and put with the other dolls. <laughs> she's just so funny. Look at that face. And she's got some serious lashes going on. I decided to go on and do the heavy lashes on her top. And I'm kind of glad I did. Originally when I did her, I kind of had her eyelashes a more droopy. And I didn't like I wanted her to look sleepy. And uh, so I had to take them off and redo them. So you see a little piece right here. I guess I need to touch up because when I pulled it off, I pulled some paint off. Ah, it's always some little thing I gotta fix. Anyway, she's adorable. She looks good with her other little siblings. Okay, I just love her mouth. I'm sorry. This is just the funniest mouth. Look at that. Look at that lip. It's just crazy. And always when I do babies, I like to make their noses a little runny. It's just my thing. It's just what I do. Anyway, I'm gonna have her on eBay. Her starting bid will be $99.99, and I'm hoping she finds a new home. I put a lot of work into her, and I hope someone can appreciate it and put her with their collection.